Hi, I'm Chef Kevin O'Connor, Cobram Estates Chef at Large. We're out here in one of our most beautiful olive groves in Winters, California, with real California milk and California grown, showing you guys how to make the perfect grazing board. All right, so this dry jack is aged for months up to years sometimes. It's nice and crumbly. It's perfect for shaving and grating into pastas, salads. These little wheels of brie are just perfect size if you're eating it by yourself, but I like to use them on my cheese boards as well. And we've got a great texture. This blue cheese from Marin County is among one of my favorites. It's got these amazing veins of green and blue. It's nutty, super creamy, it melts well, it crumbles well, and it's a necessity on my boards. And this is a camembert from Marin County. It's great if you want to bake it when you're entertaining. I mean, it's also great to see it raw. All right, this creme fraiche is great for cheese boards and savory and sweet applications. I just like to mix in some crushed black pepper, sprinkle a sea salt, and some fresh olive oil. But you can also add some honey and put it on some fresh fruit. This is a beautiful jack. This one's infused with garlic and herbs, and I think everybody likes this cheese. This smoked jack cheese from the Sierras is also really good in baking. It adds a subtle smokiness to anything you might want to grate it into or on top of. This mini wheel of brie is inoculated with fresh black truffle. It helps add a touch of elegance to just about any grazing board or snack sesh. I've been cooking with and eating pears from the Delta my entire life and another necessity on a grazing board. These grapes are honestly some of the best grapes I've ever had. These figs are coming from Yolo County, not too far from here. I think among the best for just eating. They add an amazing pop of color to your cheese plate. Kiwis are grown all throughout the San Joaquin Valley, and they're one of the healthiest fruits out there. Not a lot of people know that. I love the sweet acidity that kiwis offer, especially on a cheese and charcuterie plate. Now, it definitely wouldn't be a California grazing board without California nuts. We've got roasted pistachios and almonds to highlight the nutty flavors in the cheese, and to also add a little bit of crunch. These California prunes are actually fire dried plums grown out here in Yolo County. They're a necessity for any cheese board. I don't even have to tell you how healthy these guys are. I think we all know. And I'm always sure to greet my guests with fresh bread and fresh California extra virgin olive oil to dip. Don't even need to add anything to it. If you have fresh, high quality extra virgin olive oil, it tastes good enough without the balsamic herbs or anything else. Super fresh, super simple, and super delicious, and you guys can do it too. All of these amazing California products can be found at Rayleigh's, Bel Air, and Knob Hill.